What's going on, YouTube? Shabai Fat Junior 2000. Yeah, me? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh huh. Ha <laughs> ha. Whatever. All right, let's do it. Uh, so um, it's been a minute, I'm saying. It's been a minute, but uh, I'm back. I'm saying uh, got ah, I'm falling so behind, guys, in my videos. I got so many videos I have not put up yet, but. Hopefully, eventually, one by one, whatever, I'll get them all up eventually, right? So, with that being said, uh, got a package, and I'm saying, gonna unbox it for you. This was a, a, a weighted game for me. Um, really wanted it. Um, very excited about it. Um, read a lot of reviews about it, and nothing but good things. Nothing. The, the fact of how it utilizes the 3D. Um, to, to actually solve um, solve things within the boards with it within the maps um, the fact that it's a mixture of they said like a Mario 64 with Mario Galaxy kinda or is it Mario Land mixed with with Mario Galaxy y'all get the y'all get the picture and they just said it's amazing I'm not gonna lie I haven't been using my 3ds at all it's hard when you have Batman, um, Arkham City, and, you know, um, still haven't beaten um, Gears of War 3, you know what I mean, uh, Modern Warfare 3, been trying to play a little bit of Battlefield 3, um, so it's really difficult. I think that I'm starting, maybe maybe I'm getting too much, I don't know how to really put it, but i um, definitely not able to use a lot of my stuff. And then, you know, when the PSP Vita hits, I'm probably going to be getting that as well. So, you know, <clears throat> a lot of games tend to be become a little bit overwhelming, and then you don't get to play and use everything. So, I don't know. i got to figure that out. I think, um, I don't know, maybe my PS3 will get sold. Obviously, the number one system is the 360. Definitely not getting rid of my 3DS, number one, because my mother bought it for me. And I explained to you guys how I, I really prize things that my mom buys for me. Um, and number two, because that system, I mean, I think the first year was horrible for that system. And I think from now on, these people are going to get really fucking serious and say, yo, we got to release, you know, nothing but quality games. You know, who knows if they're going to use the, the Call of Duty and, you know, maybe utilize the 3D with that to make the, the boards look a little more in-depth. I mean, you know, there's a lot of great things, you know, Animal Crossing, I'm not really big on that, but a lot of people love that game, it's a very popular game, you know, I love Sims games, um, you know, I'm obviously Luigi's Mansion, is definitely one of, Luigi's Mansion 2 and Mario Kart are definitely two that I'm really looking forward to, I'm also looking forward to a Kirby um, adventure, um, and, you know, just a lot of good stuff, they said they're already working on a new Zelda for the 3DS, so um, I'm very excited about that. Um, anyway, without further ado, let's get to the unboxing. Um, once again, you know this this was something that I really wanted. Um, I got it for a really good price, as usual. You know how I do, guys. I got it for like 34 bucks, no tax, free shipping, everything all together. <clears throat> you know, usually I don't pay above 35 dollars for a 3DS game, or else I feel like I'm getting ripped off. Um, but, uh, yeah, so, you know, my brother's gonna wait for Christmas to open his, fluck all that, you know what I'm saying? I got it now, I'm gonna play it now, I'm gonna beat it before Christmas, that's for sure. Um, so here it is, you know what I'm saying? Super Mario 3D Land, you know what I'm saying? I've been looking forward to this one, big, big, big game for the 3DS, um, actually, you know, ground uh you know um this is this is really like um this this changes the game for the 3ds as far as the competitors and everything i mean this is one of those kind of games you know these this is game game of the year material you know once the, once the 3ds starts um um releasing original titles of zelda <clears throat> metroid mario mario kart any games like that that release for the 3d um for the nintendo products automatically you know every every other handheld system or every other console is on the ropes because those games are just always you know you never 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 I think Mario 
um, Zelda and Metroid are the three exceptions where you never, ever, 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 you know, along with games, I think like Gears of War, they would never release a shitty thing, you know, Grand Theft Auto, <clears throat> you know, so, you know, there's certain, you know, Drake's, Drake's uh, Fortune, you know, that game, um, those are games that you never have to worry, you know, like an Assassin's Creed could suck, you know what I'm saying, games like that could suck, uh, you know, um, <clears throat> you always get quality, the Marvel vs. Capcom games, you know, you always get quality with games like that, you know, the Mortal Kombat games could suck, you know, there's a lot of uh, a big genre games that could suck, but with those games, with the Marios and the Zeldas and the Metroids and the Gears of War, those games, you always know what you're going to get, and I think that's the beauty of these games. You automatically buy it. You know, I didn't have to, I just wanted to read reviews to see, you know, what they thought, but I didn't read reviews to, to, to determine if I was going to purchase the game. You know what I'm saying? Every single person, which it'll never happen, and, and, and ever, until, you know, never, just ever, in, in another century, a million centuries from now, it'll never happen. A Mario title game will never be considered not good, um, low budgeted, you know, um, not fully complete. You know, you always get your quality shit when you, <clears throat> when you purchase some of these Nintendo exclusives. And that in itself, I have to give Nintendo much kudos to the fact that they always release their quality Nintendo games. All the other, you know, third party games and all, they're pretty much trash, you know. Um, but they, these games are absolutely wonderful. Um, I know I'm talking a lot. I just I'm sorry. I get really excited when it become when it comes to these Mario games because when you play it, it's like you're not gonna play anything like it. You know what I mean? I thought like like the Street the Street Fighter the Street Fighter game I thought was freaking horrible. I hated it. It just you know the graphics were great, but I didn't like the tempo. I didn't like I just really didn't like it. You know um, <clears throat> what with this. You know, hands down, no question. I'm going to enjoy it. I'm going to love it. I'm going to have a great time solving the puzzles, <clears throat> getting through the obstacles. You know, it's just going to be great. Um. So, anyway, let me uh, let me try to get it open. Show you real quick what's inside, you know, which is typical shit. But regardless, you know, so I'm opening it. Um. But, yeah, man, you know, this game, this is the real deal, man. This is a Mario game, and it's original. You know, it's not Star Fox 64. It's not Mario 64. You know, Zelda 64. This is an original. You know what I mean? Okay, so this is what you get inside. Obviously, the Mario game with Mario on there. You know what I'm saying? You get this. Um, as far as <clears throat> you know, and then I love the fact that they always give you a lot of documentations promoting their other uh, fellow Nintendo games. You know, obviously, games that I already have. You know, um, you know, um, I didn't get the Tetris. Might get it. Um, Zelda, Star Fox 64. Um, you know, shows you a little bit. I actually played a little bit of Zelda the other week, and I was having. Um, I played it inside of my in my library of my uh, college, and I was having an awesome time with it. I love it. Absolutely love it. Um, Love Nintendo games, they're awesome. So yeah, I guess this is like the, this is like a, a fold-out manual, which basically tells you how to do like the moves and shit. I don't think they really need to go too hard on it, you know, just pretty straightforward Mario shit. Um, obviously you get the pin number and ClubNintendo.com. Uh, you get the pin number for Club Nintendo, where where basically um. You know, you put in the code, the code is there, and you put in the code, and there you go, you know. Got to cover it up, because who knows if I'll even play the game before I put this video, because I usually put exciting videos like this up right away. So definitely got to cover the code, I don't want to try it and know that somebody else on YouTube used it. Um, so yeah guys, this is a unboxing and a quick overview of Mario... Uh, Land 3D. Once again, you know what you're getting when you get, you know, games like this. Obviously, quality shit right here. Um, yeah, and that's basically it. Your boy Fat Joe Jr. 2001. 
as always, please rate, comment, and subscribe. You know, um, any questions, once again, don't hesitate to ask. Your boy's here for you. You know what I'm saying? I'm always willing to help a fellow tuber. And, um, yeah, that's about it. Uh, oh, more videos to come. Just purchase some good shit. Um, like, I have no more money left. I'm like in debt and shit, but I continue to just go crazy because that's just... It's what I do, you know, spend money, buy electronics, buy shit. It's what makes me happy, and it's what I do. And you know what? There's nothing wrong with that, you know. Some people spend money on on, on negative things, you know, like prostitutes and all kind of disgusting other things. You know, at least I spend my money, you know, with little things that make me happy, and it's not, you know, detrimental to any other person. Or nobody's going to be like, oh, my God, look what he's doing. Look what... You know what I mean? Like, they're going to be like, okay, well, that's his shit. Right? So, I'm not going to talk about it. I'm not going to tell you what it is, but definitely some good unboxings coming. Um, I think you guys are going to really like this. And, um, yeah, you guys are definitely going to like it. So, more coming. Stay tuned. Your boy Fat Joe. After that, who knows? I might take a break. You know, times is rough now. So, I might calm it down. But after this, after these nice little upcoming things that are coming so stay tuned your boy fat joe jr 2001 um all right then see you later